Okay. Right. Now, we're going to do some mini roundabouts and we're going to do some major roundabouts, okay? Okay. It's a very important lesson for you. Okay. Because if you want to drive around, you're going to face roundabouts all the time. Especially back when we're driving, we've got loads of roundabouts. Okay. Now, look ahead. You have got a triangle sign there. Yeah. With a roundabout shape in the middle there, yeah? Yeah. What is that triangle sign telling you? Information. That there's a roundabout. What is, okay. Stuff. What's the difference between the triangle sign and the circle sign? What does the triangle sign tell you? What does uh, the circle sign tell you? The triangle one is a warning. Is a warning. And then the circle is information. Order. Order. Okay. Yeah, information and order, whatever you want to call it. Okay. okay. So, the triangle sign is a warning you what's coming up ahead? A runabout. Mm. A now, minute. it's not warning you what type of roundabout is coming. A mini one. Yeah, but it's not warning you that. It's warning you. Oh, okay, what type it's coming. So, okay. for example, let me give you my experience let's say you go to the building you knock mm -hmm. the door the security guard over there mm -hmm. and you ask is anybody in the building and the security guard say yeah there's some human beings in there what is not telling you whether it's a male female mm -hmm. kids or whatever it is is just telling you somebody's in there that triangle sign is similar like that it's just warning you there's a roundabout coming up okay it's not warning you what type of roundabout is coming? Oh, okay. A lot of people think it's a mini roundabout. Yeah, no, you I can thought. see this on a major roundabout as well though, okay. yeah? The actual mini roundabout sign mm -hmm. is the blue circle sign oh. with three arrows in the middle. Okay. That sign is telling you there's a mini roundabout there right on the floor. Okay. Do you understand this? Yeah. yeah. Now, because you're doing it first time, I will doing over teaching to you okay and then hopefully gradually I will give you the control and you make your own decision so first round I will talk you through though yeah okay okay so drive off please whenever you are ready please for me so we have got a warning sign coming up That's, a roundabout is coming yeah and a blue sign coming up telling you the mini roundabout yeah. now if there's a wall there, it's a closed view. Mini yeah. roundabout. So start slowing down. Lean your body forward towards the steering. Look in your right and look ahead as well. Anyone coming from the right? No. No, check so your mirrors and go now okay. quickly. Push your speed quicker. That's it. But always check your mirrors before making Move. any progress. Okay. So Move. there's a warning sign coming up again. There's another one. Another roundabout, roundabout is coming. But how many roundabout coming? How many blue signs there? Um, two. two. That means two mini roundabouts. Okay. Keep using your brakes. Now this mini roundabout mm -hmm. is an open view because there's no right yeah, road over there. Yeah. Any car signaling coming into your danger no. zone. So keep going slowly. Just glance once you're left and just go quickly. That's it. That's it. Good. Another one. So you this one down. is an open, open view. view. Glance but look ahead. Anyone coming? No. No. Check so all three mirrors and push your speed move. now. Check all three mirrors and then accelerate, good. So this, if you look ahead, mm -hmm. there is a blue circle, circle with one arrow. It's a big it, roundabout. It's a major roundabout yeah. and there is no arrows painted. No. We have to use a clock method. We are going straight ahead. So, there's so no start need to show now. slowing down, positioning, start looking early. Anyone coming to your danger zone? No. So go near to the left curb island there, no, no. Go there, oh, yeah, there. Check your mirrors. Signal down. We're going there. Second exit. Okay. That was the first exit. Oh. <laughs> Check your mirrors and, and build up a speed. Okay. Now, this is a tricky one. I'm going to talk you through this. We're going to be following the sign Blackburn. Pay attention to this, mm -hmm. yeah? Okay. We're going to be following the sign Blackburn. It will also help you for the roundabouts as well, though, yeah? Okay. So, there's a sign there telling you on the top, also Trizel. Uh, then it straight. says Blackburn on your left. Can you see that? Oh yeah. Okay. So, so we're we gonna see. be so because we're turning left, what we need to do now? Mirrors, mirrors and indicate. Because you're crossing over the cycle lane, check your mirror again and then go over there. And what is the warning there? They can be pedestrians no, also. Give oh, way give as well sorry. and pedestrians. So start looking early. Anyone coming from your right? Um no. no. So stay in the left lane. Left lane, left lane is yours. 
And what is the sign telling you? Black one which exit? Straight. Straight. Second exit. Second exit. We're staying in this lane. Okay. So same thing again. So we approach slowly. Start looking early. Positioning. Any blockers for this car positioning? No blockers. We no. need and it's oh. coming towards you as well. There you go. Anybody else? Uh, He's going there. So after we, the first island, we show your signal. Signal down. Because that is your which exit? Second exit. Second exit. Because first was there, isn't it? Yeah? Yeah. Built up your speed. So black bun is where? Ahead. She's ahead of us. Now there is no signboard over there, correct? Yeah. How can you tell which exit you're taking? Arrows will help you. Okay. So on our lane, you have got two arrows painted left, left and ahead. ahead. Because black bun is ahead, so which exit are we taking? Ahead. Which so exit second. number? Second. So slow approach, start looking early and look ahead though as well. Anyone mm. coming towards you? No. No? Then no. you can go for me. Go near to the island. And now check your center in the left mirror, signal down and follow which curb? Uh, left, the left curb. curb. Because two lanes over there. Yeah. That's it. Good. That's it. Well done. So again, we are still going towards Blackburn, right? Yeah. And Blackburn is ahead. Yeah. So we have got a roundabout coming up again. Mm -hmm. How many arrows? Two arrows. Two. So we're going ahead which number of exits? The second exit. Good. So start slowing down. Positioning. Anyone more position? Anyone coming? Yes. Anyone else? No. Go near to the island. Everything is step by step. Yeah. Easy. Now check your mirrors. Signal down. Keep following the bend. Keep following the curb. Don't worry about cancelling your signal yet. Just keep going. Keep going. Once your wheel straightened, now you can cancel it. Check your mirrors and build up a speed. Make sense? Yeah. So you have a sign board coming up. So we're going towards Blackburn. Which is what? the straight second exit. Uh -uh, first what? exit this oh, okay. time because yeah, there's no. There. Yeah. So that means this is not part of the roundabout. No. You're going first exit. So I'm slowing down. Positioning. Everything is still normal. Anyone coming? Go no. this way. Check your mirrors and signal down. Mirrors first. I, you need to move your head. Okay. I did not see your head movements. A lot of multitasking, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Check your mirrors and build separate speed. Okay, so start slowing down a little bit. What blue sign telling you what's coming up ahead? Um, a runabout. Major runabout, isn't it? Yeah, so start slowing down again. We're going to use a clock method. Positioning, start Position. looking early. Looking ahead as well. Anyone coming? Um, no. No? Okay. So go near to the island and now check your mirrors. Mirrors, this one, and indicate down. That's it, good and then cancel your signal and then build separate speeds.